Still reeling from the impact of Cyclone Queensland, the last thing Julia Gillard needs is the ongoing saga of Craig Thompson. And now an embarrassment, an albatross around her neck, an all-round bloody nuisance. But while tiresome, Thompson will not necessarily be fatal to the government. And if he is, it certainly won't be as a result of the Fair Work Australia report into the dealings of the Health Services Union. Let's be clear about what Fair Work Australia is. It's not a police force. It's not an investigating agency. It's not a legal prosecuting arm of government or of anybody else. It's an independent body charged with making sure that there is fair dealing between unions and employers and indeed within union and employer ranks. And what it found with the Health Services Union was of course that there hadn't been. There had been 181 different breaches of regulations and rules and these were obviously things that would need to be dealt with. But they were not, repeat not, necessarily criminal offences and it wasn't Fair Work Australia's job to work out whether they were or not. As a matter of courtesy, the report has been passed to the Commonwealth Prosecutor's Office and the Commonwealth Prosecutor has said quite properly that it doesn't constitute a brief of evidence and that he therefore is unable to take conclusions from it. If this is to happen, it'll have to be as a result of a police report or a legal report of some kind which has status within the Act. Now, there's nothing to stop either of these things happening, but they haven't happened yet. And they're not likely to happen in the foreseeable future either, if the past is anything to go by. Thus, Thompson is very much off the legal hook. And Tony Abbott's claims to take over the government, on which he's been basing so much of his crusade against Craig Thompson, look as silly as the rest of his non-policies. The only people who can dismiss Craig Thompson from Parliament are the electors. He is the elected member for Dobell. He may be expelled from the Labor Party, although, again, on past performances this looks extremely unlikely, but he can't be tossed out of Parliament. Neither Tony Abbott nor anybody else can do that. The only thing that can, apart from Thompson dying or resigning of his own accord, is to be found guilty of a criminal charge. Not just charged, but found guilty and convicted. And once again, this is highly unlikely to happen. Abbott's crusade can only be a moral one. It can only be based on trying to convince the independents to cross the floor on the basis that Thompson is some sort of a bastard. Well, this may well be true, but then so is Tony Abbott, and the independents have so far resisted signing with him. I suspect they'll continue to do so. I'm Mungo McCallum. <laughs>